Also today, just fooling around, I brought out my P1 pistol. Um, it's made by Walter. I think uh, 1079 is the manufacture date. And basically what it is is just a post-war version of the P38 with an alloy frame. It's just a P38, more modern version. This was probably issued by the, the Germans. That's how it gets to P1. Now you will find these post-war alloy frame guns with P38 on it. A friend of mine bought one, thought it was an original P38, but the P1 is what the German designation is for it. It's still a Walter P38, just of a more recent manufacturer. And there were several countries that did adopt this. South Africa and a couple Scandinavian ones. And I'm not going to do a review or nothing on it. A lot of people have. It's an interesting gun uh, for its time. Had a lot of innovations. Double action. Uh, the decocker and that. But the strange thing about this pistol is it has like a tight throat or something. It won't take my uh, reloads. It won't take those cast bullets. And it won't chamber wolf ammo. I found an old box. Just plain old Winchester. Uh, Western ammo, just plain Janers, and it seems to work all right. So we're going to give this a little try. Get a few rounds out of it. Okay, let's go down and take a look and see how we did. Well, not too bad. Most of that's probably me. I know I had this one flyer when I jerked and that. Just got to practice more. You know, I wish I could afford two, three hundred rounds to put through it. Sit there all afternoon, take my time, get my grip and trigger control down. But still not a bad gun, surplus gun. Probably with practice that can become better with a good reload too. But, thought I'd throw that in. Okay. I got enough ammo for two more mag loads. I'm gonna see if I can improve on my last. Get more of them in that red.
we'll take a look and call it a day. A little bit better. Still going low and to the left. That's something to do with my grip and holding a gun. It's just practice. Going to correct that. But eight and nine, so not a bad gun. Something just for a little more practice, get better.